I guess the way that it started was that I am a business owner and um, had plywood in the front of my business. Um, and yeah, I guess Gina Franco contacted me wanting to do something um, and came by and then that's just kind of how it evolved. She painted on my, my building and then it was a situation of why not carry this on um, and just so happened that news uh, reporters were downtown covering uh, what took place over the weekend. And so it was that following day, it was a Monday, and um, I was just, you know, visually just picturing like all these like blank canvases all of a sudden. Um, so I reached out to Jen um, and I was like, do you mind if I come paint on your store? Um, and she was like, yeah, absolutely, you know, no questions. Um, and so I came, I don't even remember what time it was. It's kind of late in the afternoon for me. It was like probably two, three o'clock. Might have been even earlier than that. Yeah. And yeah. then we just kind of sat outside and just kind of, you know, talked about, you know, there wasn't really a plan of what I was going to do. Um, I just had whatever colors I had in my car and, you know, I knew I wanted to do all three of hers. And so I just started um, and, you know, used everything from my studio, kind of just pulled a bunch of stuff, threw it in my car, came down here. Um, and we were able to knock those out um, before curfew, because we had curfew um, then. Um, but yeah, and um, so it was the, they were the news people, you know, we kind of talked about, um, I just, I think I simply just said, hey, if you're an artist and, you know, you want to come volunteer your time or, you know, and kind of like um, continue this visual protest is kind of how I explained it like you know because the protesters were down here also you know we were side, I thought felt like we were side by side I mean it was so many people coming down that week um, to, to see the beautiful messages and art that um, the community came out to to speak um, through painting and it was just I, I was like you know what I'm closing the store we're gonna focus only on getting as many artists um, on bu business uh, um, buildings, uh, on the plywood, um, and giving them a chance to, to speak.